He's a creator, host, executive producer, and recording artist who's been featured in Forbes, Glad, CNN, and so many more to promote his fun music style and songwriting abilities. Here to discuss more about his career and perform live for us is Thomas Orlina. Thomas, thanks so much for joining us today. Thank you so much for having me. Yeah, it's excited to have you here on the sofa with me today. Now, yes. Thomas, you are just an array of amazing things. Singer, songwriter, entertainer, yeah. advocates. But for our viewers who maybe never heard of you or what you do, give us an overall view. Yeah, you know, I'm just overall wanting to put out really great messaging out there, inspiring other people to also let them know that they can do it as well. So if I can be a champion for that, I want to be like that for everybody. That's amazing. And when did your singing and songwriting career first take off? Can you remember? Mm -hmm. Yeah, you know, ever since I was a kid, I've always been very creative. I've always wanted to write down, you know, musics or melodies or things like that. So I've always kind of had it in me. But it was like during the pandemic that I really yeah. was like, this is the time to do it. And so that's where a lot of the creative creativity kind of began for the music. And you did get a lot of notoriety for your music, your songwriting <laughs> abilities. Can can you walk me through what that was like for you when you first kind of got noticed on a bigger level? Yeah, it was so exciting. I had gotten reached out by Forbes to cover my music video, which we covered so many different topics, the Black Lives Matter movement, the LGBTQ community. It was such an amazing project. I had so many amazing people come out and celebrate that. And when I got reached out on social media, it was just like, I felt like the wheel started turning and I was like, wow, this is really taking off and it, I just haven't stopped since then. Amazing. And tell us a little bit about that song and that music video, what it meant to you and the passion you put behind it. Yeah, you know, and this is the song that I actually wrote a long time ago and I just knew that there was going to be a time for it and I just wanted people to feel empowered. That's always like whenever I post things on social media, it's always to really impact others and make them feel good. So when you watch the music video, uh, you'll definitely see all the themes and like, as I mentioned again, there was so many people that came out to celebrate it. So mm -hmm. I think that's why it's gotten so much attention and gotten a lot of big, uh, you know, platforms to cover it. Amazing. So you're an incredible advocate out there and we just appreciate that so much. But what do you hope that fans and viewers alike take away from your music and you as an entertainer? I would just hope that they would see that anybody can do it with hard work. Uh, it, it definitely takes a lot of hard work, dedication. Uh, I definitely think having a plan and also the people that you surround yourself with is so important. Uh, people that uplift you, people that are, you know, championing you and motivating you. I think that's what I've been able to do is be around those types of people. Yeah. And just my producers and my dancers, everybody that's helped me get here. Uh, it definitely wasn't all me, so I have to give credit to everybody that's gotten me here. Amazing. So here in just about 60 seconds, we're going to watch you perform live with some of your crew, but give us a background of the mashup that you're going to be performing today. Yeah, um, I recently just performed uh, and I wanted to do kind of a quick melody of all of the songs to give your audience a taste of my music. Yeah. Uh, so we do Brush It Off, Journey, This Time, and I Want It Right Now. Uh, I Want It Right Now is actually my latest single, but we're back in the studio. We're recording a new song. We're working on a documentary. There's so many things that we're working Ooh, on, so okay. I'm really excited for uh, my followers, my fans to see like what's coming up next. Okay, so I, you got me excited. <laughs> I'm really, really excited now. So why don't you go ahead and get in place and while you, you do that, um, he's going to get ready, everybody, again.